Lemonade is an insurance company that went public in 2020. Its shares have fallen almost 50% year to date. The company just announced its quarterly results for Q4 and results have beaten the expectations by 4.6%. Is Lemonade one to keep on the watch list if it continues to fall? The sustainability of the stock's immediate price movement based on the recently released numbers and future earnings expectations will mostly depend on management's commentary on the earnings call. Let us have a look at the key takeaways from the recently released shareholder letter. Enforced premium is up 78% year over year, customer count up 43% to almost 1.5 million customers. But the gross loss ratio is up to 96% from 73% last year. In 2021, Lemonade launched the Lemonade car and acquired Metro Mile. Looking to 2022, the management expects there will be a shift to the next phase of company growth. Being able to offer pet, life and car insurance in addition to home and renters was the first step. We expect that the balance will now shift and over the coming quarters and years this shift we will take our business to new levels of efficiency, growth and profitability. Indeed, 2022 is expected to be our year of peak losses. Now to the loss ratio. The US-based renters represent now less than half of the book, down from 66% a year ago. The lines of business that have captured the share, home and pet insurance demonstrate higher loss ratios than Lemonade's more major, stable renter's book. So the management's goal is to improve underwriting profitability in their newer lines of business. This puts us on a path to getting the loss ratios of all Lemonade product lines to under 75%, but in the near term it's possible we'll see quarters with loss ratios above this level as our newer lines mature. This is to be expected and is a natural and temporary cost of launching and scaling new products. While Lemonade has underperformed the market so far this year, the question that comes to our investors' minds is what's next for the stock? There are no easy answers to this key question, but the estimate revisions trend for Lemonade remains mixed. It will be interesting to see how estimates for the coming quarters and current fiscal year change in the days ahead. The current consensus earnings per share estimate is minus 0.87 dollars on 43.5 million dollars in revenues for the coming first quarter in 2022. So what are your thoughts for Lemonade? Let me know in the comments below and thank you very much for watching.